Hey guys, Metroid Saxon here. Welcome back to Dawn of War 2. Today, well, in this episode, we are doing a spider among flies. Let's hear the briefing. Commander, we have located a substantial Eldar strike force. This force appears to be led by one of their so called warp spiders. Warp spiders are capable of rapid teleportation, which may explain how the Eldar are monitoring the orcs on Typhon without being seen. Eliminate him and uncover what you can of the Eldar plans on Typhon. So apparently this target is vulnerable to close combat. <laughs> Yet warp spiders are, like the warp spider Exar is close combat himself. Oh, the Eldar. Very powerful race. Very powerful race. But they have their flaws. Well, I've got a floor. I'm sitting on it, more or less. <laughs> but no. That big orange thing in the back, that's the Avatar. That thing has some firepower. Don't need to see this. Now, on this map, there it is. Me, well, us coming in first. Commander, our scanners place the warp spider in the position marked on your map. He will not stay there for long. We should move. Agreed, right. but watch for traps. So there's an automated foundry. And an Imperial Shrine. We're gonna go for the Foundry first. I need to... S I didn't bring Cyrus. Your chapter and repositioning. Our weapons are ready. Brothers, this is that Assault squad on the way. There's some warp spiders. <laughs> Prepare for combat. <laughs> open fire. Stop warping! Return fire. I'm gonna just punch him in the face. How can we serve? Oh, you son of a bitch! Right into my grenade. Perfect. As a hawk in the sky, we swoop from perch to perch. Yeah, how comes I'm blowing your ass up? Answer that one. Come on. That didn't work. I can put Let's get these guys back. So I'm going to use tactical advance to counter the effects of the sniper. Don't waste that. No, oh, wasted. This is relocating. So basically, I'm just trying to keep them all bunched up for now. I know this doesn't always sound like the best idea. But when you want to drop shit like that. Oh god, Banshees! Yeah, I forgot about the Banshees, they are one of the most annoying things in this game. You orders for us. Yeah, you're moving there. Rick. That is a sniper's and roost. Tactical Marines awaiting orders. Repositioning. Right, we need to get this foundry soon as really. I need to close my curtain so I can see what I'm doing, because that rain's not helping. It's trippy. Devastator Marines ready for combat. Adjust your positions. Tactical Marines awaiting. Advancing. Assault acknowledged. Gotta keep an eye on everything at the moment. Ah, I knew there was one. Ranger squad. Prepare for combat. Remain vigilant. 
Excellent. All weapons are ready. Adjust your positions. Assault squad ready for Enemy the Emperor's name. This is why it's saying bring siren. Well, none of the squads died at least. Now we just wait for the commander to activate the foundry, and then we can bounce out and move on to another mission. Okie dokie dokie. Excuse me. I'm very tired. I've been ill for the last couple of days, as you know. Field generators are deploying now, Commander. Additional generators will not be available to my next deployment. That's fine. Because I got two more deployments on this day. Not one more. But at least I can go pop and get rid of that. Um, I don't think Avatus is the best option for this. Because, um, well, he takes time to set up. And I need quick motion. Motion? <laughs> quick motion. I need quick motion in and out of this mission. Um... Oh! Okay. Well, that gets rid of suppression and it heals. Ah, fuck, fuck the iron halo. Sod the first. Commander. Yes, we know he's vulnerable to hand-to-hand -hand combat. That's why I've given my commander the power axe, a little bit more aggressive. Sometimes the power axe is actually more powerful than a thunder fist because it gets more attacks off. I need to see this. Yay, no more rain. It's daytime. Nighttime. Daytime. Commander, our scanners place the warp spider in the position marked on your map. He will not stay there for long. We should move. Agreed. But watch for traps. Get Hence why I brought you Cyrus. I'm so glad I brought Cyrus. Warp spiders. We are Surprise, I brought you into my trap. Damage someone's little army. Be vigilant. Right. What was down there? Oh yeah, that was the hidden squads. Silent movement. That's a full. That's almost a full banshee. Four soldiers trying to get a precise count. Two Banshee squads, three Guardians. The Banshees aren't full, but the Guardians are. Coming out of stealth. <laughs>
Okay, I can deploy the tarantula there. Definitely on the fly from my law. It is done. Move on. That was too easy. Move quickly. Way too easy. Nice, no, especially since they're warp spiders. It's only a half squad as well. Right. I need to get that point, and I need that point there because it's the closest Colosseum point. Be vigilant. If I use Cyrus to sort of judge, it's not yet too soon. Isn't there like a turret here? It said. Oh no, it's just guardians. Boobity boobity boob. Push. Reporting. Tactical squad repositioning. Reporting in. Coordinates fixed. As you order. Let's see what we've got. I see guardian squads. Any snipers I can take out? There's another guardian squad. More warp spiders. That's what. Readiness is all. Um, for Syntarchus there, I want to keep the commander nearby, because I'm using Cyrus as just like, you know, there's something here, please kill it with me. Cyrus, fall back. <laughs> Beware, the Eldar are deadly! Well, no shit. They're mainly witches of the warp. Oh look! A ranger! Fire at will. We will thin their ranks. Assault squad repositioned. Yeah, it's the assault squad's your best friend in Spider of the Warp because, well. You've literally got to be in and out on some of these fights. Right. I need to head back on the myself. Here, Commander. Are they really? Oh god, Banshees. Their 
Yeah, you jump into assault marines and a commander. It's not the smartest move, Eldar. And I've seen smarter. Well, Eldar aren't that smart. They're fucking squishy. They're squishy. They're cowardly and they sacrifice millions just to save one. I'm sorry, but the term the needs of one does not outweigh the needs of the many. Not to quote Spock there. God, may God rest his soul. Um, right, where are we heading next? Oh. Now I remember. The chapters I have to be ready for any warp spiders. No cloak. My judgments are best in shadow. Right, we got banshees, guardians. Alright, if I put the commander up front. Tark is behind him. And have Thaddeus waiting there. Edge my units closer every second. How can we repositioning? Easy, easy. I really want to use a high powered shot, but I don't at the same time. That'll just about skim them. Yes. I can't move them any closer, they're at the maximum close. How can we sir? Remain vigilant. How close them. Alright then, we throw a demolition charge. Decloak and fall back. because I can get an eyes view. Now I know there's a good couple of Banshee squads in there. I have a close fallback position at least. Well, close-ish. There they are. I knew if I hang in here they'll pull them out. Oh, don't kill one of my space marines, you bitch! Cut those alien bastards down. Alright, you there, you there, you there, you there. Get to you that Time to fall back. Where's that ranger? Gotcha. Ah, Brigandine and Swiftness. That's a good one. How far can I jump in? Oop, not very. Tarkus let them on the attack. Let them fear. Oh yeah, he's got the blessing of fortitude, which I need in a minute. Be vigilant. 
Follow me, brothers. Okie dokie dokie dokie. Tarkus needs one more unit, so we're gonna wait until the commander has captured that. Then we're gonna head and take this spider's web down. Field generators are deploying now, Commander. Additional generators will not be available until your next deployment. Okay, that's fine. I can put Chapters recruit stand ready. Oh yeah, I remember I need to send Cyrus in on his own, really. Be vigilant. Tactical Marines awaiting. Advancing. We need only a word. No. Eldar down. Follow me, brothers. All right. For the chapter. Where's that other one? There he is. All right, I need to get rid of that ranger. Pop goes the bandit. Cyrus. Cyrus. Assault squad, ready to use a grenade! Prepare for combat. Engage my Eldar! Barrier assault, go! Death from above, kill X amount of targets with the assault gun skill if I remember correctly. So you have two runaway points. Objective taken. Good. Three squads getting redeployments. Assault squad, take your position, brother. Hey. Okay. Right, now I've got to plan my attacks because Cyrus can suppress him. He is suppress not invulnerable to suppression, surprisingly. Um Melee's his weakness because he exarchs are supposed to be the melee pures, but they're more ranged in the warp spider um, splinter tree. Um, so I have myself and Thaddeus attacking him. Cyrus and Tarkus will cause or will run interference. So if I drop that one there. Destination control. Be vigilant. Assault squad repositioning. Jesus! There he is! Wait. Is he smiling? Here you come, like good little prey. Now, if you would just do me the further kindness of dying. We bring reinforcements. Eliminate them. Another angle, I think. Try to wiggle out of this, worms. Eldar, close and engage. It is done. Move on. There he is. Destroy them. Danger. We have to move. Position, brother. Hit them hard, hit them fast. 
A predator stumbles, and he becomes prey. He considered us mere prey. Yeah, no big mistake. Big mistake against the Space Marines. They're not prey. Especially when they've got big adamantium cannons that fire uranium shells. So yes, the spider has fallen in among his flies, and we got a blind grenade pack. Ooh. Stuns them. I mm, don't like him. Eh, not bad. Falls all round. Cyrus and Thaddeus leveled up. Oh, it's interesting armor. Enemy melee attack. Yes, run when you are attacked, but do so towards the enemy, from the lessons of Cyrus. But he's a scout. They're squishy. You stay back. Excellent work, Commander. Without warp spiders stirring up the orcs, Typhon is far more secure. No, it's not. Your victories against the orcs and Eldar have stabilized the situation on Typhon for the time being. Not all news is good, however. No. We are receiving numerous reports of local vegetation mutating, and attacks by hordes of leaping alien creatures. These creatures, what do they look like? Most of the reports are from citizens, Cyrus, and their fear makes for unreliable descriptions. I need you to return to Calderas as soon as possible. Bad Zappa's orcs have gathered for another major strike against the planetary capital. Without your support, I fear Calderas will fall. Now we're about to find out what is going on. But first things first, we need to sort out our upgrades. So two on strength for Cyrus. Thaddeus can finally wield his best weapon so far. The Snarl of the Wolf. Uh, it's 10% melee resistance, more health and more melee damage. And we need to work on getting his Terminator on, on, on us. Let's see, what don't I need? Initiates respite, knockback resistance. What's the armor? Oh Christ, it's higher. Ooh, both level 8, that's 27, that's 16, that's more accuracy and knockback resistance. Uh, I don't need the Brigand of Swiftness. Oh sweet, I leveled up. Um, right. Let's see. Yeah, we're gonna work our way up to that. Because no mercy, no respite is very powerful. When your battle cry is active, the force commander's hand hand strikes deal killing blows to most infantry. <laughs> Bada boom time. And then for Avatus, we're gonna get his sprint skill. So that means I can use him to get around quicker. Now we need to head back to Calderas for a primary mission. Melter Bomb Pack, which can only be given to Thaddeus, surprisingly. Now we send this. Right. This is it. Mech Bad Zap is our next target. I'm going to call it apart here and let you guys delve on how well I do. And th how well you think I will do. So I'll see you all in the next part, which will be the battle against Bad Zap and his orcs. Until then, take it easy and what a freedom. See ya.